now for this one here uh, start Excel download open workbook name 110 GPA to start and sell F10 use the appropriate formula to calculate the weighted average for the new GPA estimate inputs and cells F8 to F5 format uh, cell F10 is a number with two decimal places so F10 is right there F10 is there and format as a number with three decimal places. F10 is a number with two decimal places. Okay. So I right click on it. format as a number with two decimal places. Click OK. And enter the formula there. So there's a formula they give us. OK. So and F10 is where our new GPA estimate is. Credit so far. Credit so far. Here. It's an F5. GPA that's uh, GPA now is an F6. New credits this semester here is an F7 and F8 is a GPA for this semester. So I'll plug in and there's my formula. So cell F10 at equal sign. But if you notice here, um, it's a fraction bar, so I got to use parentheses to enter it correctly. So I'm going to have 5 uh, times F6 plus F7 times F8, close parentheses, divided by. Parentheses F five shift plus F seven close parentheses. Okay, and then I hit enter. It gives me the GPA there. Then they want a new GPA estimate. Inner value for the estimated GPA. So there, uh, enter. Assume the student has 72 credits and has a uh, current GPA of 2.54, but they need a 
um, 7.5 overall by the end of the semester. Do, what GP do they need in two decimal places to boost it to 2.75 okay so in a GP an estimate for the GPA um, with the GPA the number between one and four into the formula to calculate the GPA estimate. Alright. Let's see. They have two point five four now. They need to do something to pull it up. Let's do a th let's put in a three five. What do I have there for the estimate? Let's put in a three five and see what happens. Okay, so I'll put in a 3.5 here. Mm -hmm. Let me see how that boosts the GPA. Okay, so the new estimate. Okay, so. F18 is a new estimate. Uh, F13 is credit so far. Uh, GPA now. F15 is the number of credits. The estimated GPA for the semester. Will that be enough to get them to a 275? Let's find out. So that's going to go into F18. Open parentheses. Let's see. So F thirteen. F thirteen times F fourteen plus F fifteen times F sixteen close parentheses divided by open parentheses F 13 shift plus F 15 and then I hit enter uh, and I'm going to need an equal sign there Let's see if a three five was enough. So the estimate it needed to get a two seven five and I have a two seven one. So I have to change that GPA. Let's try a three nine. Three nine would do it. Let's try three seven. There, a three seven would do it. So they would have to get like a three seven. to get it to a 751 so I'll put 371 here and change that uh -oh. nope
there. And there you get it to a 371. You have to get at least a three. Uh, I put in a 3705 and format this number here between format F18 as a number of three decimal places. Okay. That's how you get that one done, and that's the end of that.